this is Kara, AKA the Principal Painter, and today I got a box. I got a big box, a big, big box, and it had my Black Friday and Cyber Monday purchases in it. It was the heaviest diamond painting box I've ever lifted, and Marlon can attest to that too, because he's the one that actually lifted it. So what I thought I would do, I have seven to one box. So what I thought I would do, I've got some that I'm gonna do in pairs because they go in pairs. These two, I'm gonna unbox one Black Friday and one Cyber Monday. Um, I'm just gonna do two. And then for this week, I will unbox as many as I can um, in some sort of order. Don't hold me to it. And I'm sorry if you're seeing flocking. I have, we have just unpacked our Christmas tree and it's a flocked tree, so. There's white fluffy stuff all over our house. I've got a vacuum after this video. So let's get into this, shall we? What am I going to do first? My first unboxing. Oh, I'm so excited about this. This one right now is sold out, but it is not limited edition. You can get notified when it comes back. It is Saint by none other than my favorite Dakota Dateweiler. <gasps> I've wanted to see this one. I got this one as fast as I could. It did sell out, so let's get into this. I mean, I just got them out of the big box, so it's still in the cellophane. Oh my gosh. I'm actually feeling pretty good about myself today, guys. We have the tree up. I'm gonna decorate it tonight, so that will be done. Yay, yay. All right, as you can see from the box, it is a square uh, diamond painting kit from the square here and the blue. Here is the thumbnail of that beautiful horse. Let's see it, shall we? And because I have two to unbox today, I'm not gonna take a whole lot of time. I'm gonna mainly show you the canvases um, and I'll show you the drills, but I'm not gonna go through them one at a time. I'll pull them out and let you see them. Here is your logbook sticker. It's got the title, the artist, the dimensions, and the shape. It, this one is a 55 by 70. You do get a new toolkit, won't go through the toolkit. Um, you do get some extra sussies in these toolkits, different colored pens, different cover minders, that sort of thing. But you wanna see this Black Friday canvas. Ah, I'm so excited. These canvases come in a nice dust bag to keep gunk off of your canvas, and they are poured glue so you can roll them back. <gasps> oh, I am so excited. The back of these canvases is buttery. Oh man, okay, I can tell there's gonna be some confetti in this thing. I can tell right now, but I'm looking, I'm looking. The rendering's looking really good, guys. I'm excited. Here are our drills you get in your kit while this is flattening out. You can roll it back again, it is poured glue. Um, this entire sheet is a sticker sheet. Look at that gorgeous image of Saint. Oh, 59 colors, four, count them, four ABs. I will tell you what an AB is momentarily. These are individual stickers you can peel off and put on your containers. That is an amazing piece of art with that horse. Oh, I'm excited information booklet with a thank you tips and tricks on how to diamond paint here are the drills are you ready to see this beauty i'm ready to see it and marlon you're gonna have to get him in on this because there wasn't a sneak peek on this so you're gonna want to see this canvas if you have not received it or seen it look at that rendering it's gorgeous it is perfection it is, I will tell you, there's a little bit more yellow in this than uh, is my taste. So what I will probably end up doing, and I've talked to several other people that said the same thing. Um, what I may do is look at replacing some of the yellow drills for more grays and more whites, uh, but still give it a little bit of contrast. Um, if you're not an experienced diamond painter, I wouldn't recommend doing that, but I feel like I could probably do some replacing on some color in here to make it a little bit less golden yellow um, because the picture, the, the original piece of art is much more white than um, this came out, but you know what? That is okay. Look at the rendering on this, guys. It is phenomenal. I am, and I'm loving the leaves up here. That's gonna be gorgeous. The flowers and the horse's mane, that peaceful look on that horse's uh, face. 
This is absolutely stunning. Again, this is, where is it? It is a 55 by 70. So it's big, but it's not like not doable. I love this. Look at the horse's blue eyes. Oh my gosh. And I love that the, the bridle is braided. I love that. So that's pretty cool. All right. I am just going to show you really quickly your color palette and show you those ABs because I have another unboxing for you from Cyber Monday. This was a Black Friday purchase. Let me flip this beauty over, show you the drills really quickly. I know you guys just were mainly interested in the canvas. You're gonna be dealing with a lot of grays, all right? More 310. Okay, coming forward, coming forward. I'm not, again, this is not a typical unboxing, just a quick run through of the colors. There's some grays, some light grays, um, some taupey colors. You're, you're getting into your caramels and your golds here. Another kind of a gray taupey color, two bags of $37.99, $37.61. All right, I see an AB in this train to Georgia. So let me wind on down 842 here is your first ab it is 105 ding 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 ring the ab bell Kara. what is an ab drill ab stands for aurora borealis it is a special coating put on these drills on the tops of them that make them shimmer and shine like no other they capture facets of light and color from the environment and drills around them and just makes them all together now shim shim shimmy shimmer just a little bit more all right so here's another AB, 141. So you got 105, you got 141. There's another AB with that coating on it. Some more of your colors here. Here's another AB, it's a blue, 101. I'm, I'm hoping some of that goes in that, that horse's beautiful eyes. Beautiful blues, lots of blues in there. Some pinks. Like I said, I'm not gonna take 12 hours to go through this because I got two to unbox for you. And again, so you're getting a gist of that color palette. Next train, do we have, we got, well, here's a short train. Let's do this one real quick. So here are some colors going through, some mauves. Ooh, you got some pinks that wanted to have fun with 422. All right, that's a short little train. And here is your last train. This is the babies. <clears throat> These are the little, um, little amounts of drills that are just gonna add some detail to your to your canvas. And you can see all those gorgeous colors. All right, ding, ding, ding. Here is your next day, B. It is 113. It is a beautiful pink. I'm thinking those go in those flowers on that horse. And just like I said, I'm just gonna go through these rather quickly. The next one I have to unbox is huge, so it's gonna take me a little bit longer. 30, 78, I wonder what it is. I wonder what the next one is that I'm unboxing. Hmm, we'll have to see. All right, so those are your colors. Let me flip this bad boy back over. I'm gonna dump this. As you know, I dump stuff on the floor. I will clean it up, I promise. All right, let me flip Saint back over. Again, you cannot beat that rendering. You just can't. I mean, oh my gosh, it's stunning. Your symbols for your AB is very easy. One, two, three, and four. Um, I'm already seeing some twos. That's that caramel color in the mane of the horse. Um, again, if I'm gonna replace to make it a little bit less gold, I could do another AB besides this two caramel color. Um, one is the blue. All right, you've got water down here and there's one sprinkled all throughout this water down at the bottom here. Uh, four is that 141. You've got fours in this water here. 141 is a very popular AB color for Diamond Art Club. Here, there's fours in the horse's face. I'm seeing that. Um, let's see. Three is that pink color. Yep, you're going to have some threes in those flowers. Am I going to have any threes in this tree? I don't see any. You're going to have threes in the flowers in the horse's mane. And I think... That is about it. I'm looking, looking, are there any? There's some fours, that, that white color in the horse's body down here and um, outlining uh, his muzzle right here, his, his nose and his mouth, it's outlining. It's also outlining uh, the bridle right here. 
Um, so that is going to be unbelievable. There are also four sprinkled throughout these flowers in the horse's mane. Oh my gosh. Again, I love Saint. This will be done and go up in my house. Again, it, it's farmhouse, so this will be perfect. And I just, I love, I, I just love this horse. I loved it. I had to get it. So that is Saint. So I'm happy to unbox it for you and let you see it. Uh, again, this is out of stock right now at Diamond Art Club, but um, you can um, hit underneath. It says um, you can click to be notified. So make sure that you click to be notified if you want this one. This is Dakota Dateweiler, uh, one of my very favorite artists. This would be one to do for uh, Dakotathon that we're doing in April. So um, love this one. Oh my gosh. All right. I'm sadly going to have to put Saint away but I will admire Saint later, I promise. All right, Saint's going over here. All right, let's talk about this next one. This next one I purchased for Cyber Monday. This one, and when I tell you this information, you're gonna know exactly which one it is. This one holds the Diamond Art Club record for greatest area of a diamond painting. And I wanna clarify this, it's not the length, Train of Dreams from Randall Spang Spangler has everybody beat on the length. It's not the height. But if you go back to high school math and you're trying to calculate area, you multiply length times width and you get the area. This is the biggest area that Diamond Art Club has ever done in a canvas. Yes, I am crazy. This one is 100 and 68 by 60. And this is like the heaviest diamond painting I've ever picked up. I could like work out with it. If you haven't guessed, it is Magic Potion by, oh my gosh, Gen uh, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to read this on the sticker sheet because this is too small for my, my eyes for the artist. But um, yeah, 168 by 60. All right, are you ready to get into this? This table is not gonna hold it. I'm gonna have to show it to you in sections. Either that or put it on the floor. And I'm six feet tall, so I may stand up and hold it for you for some perspective to see how big this diamond painting is. Oh my gosh. Also guys, I have not uh, shared with you, um, there are coupon codes all over the place. Diamond Art Club does not want you to pay full price for a diamond painting. I am also a Diamond Art Club affiliate. If you are brand new to Diamond Art Club and want to save $10 on your first purchase from Diamond Art Club, you can use the code PAINTER10. And on your very first purchase from Diamond Art Club, you can save $10 using my code. Okay, uh, I, wow. This is like heavy, guys, heavy. When I, oh my gosh. Okay, I don't think there's anything else in the box. All right, so here is, okay, Genova. Oof. Again, I'm going to have to look on the bigger sticker sheet. I'm trying to read the artist's name. It's something art. J-E-N-O-V-I-Y-A. Genovia. Genovia. I don't know. <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> Marlon's right. laughing at me. All right. So you do have your thumbnail. Diamond shape is square. This is a square diamond painting. Again, 168 by 60. Somebody get out, get out a calculator and multiply 168 by 60. You'll get the area. Um, this is the biggest area that Diamond Art Club has done. Again, not, not the length, not the width, but you have to multiply to get the area. Here is the toolkit. Uh, I do have my something sticking out the bottom here. Oh my goodness, somebody's trying to escape. I wonder, hmm, what is sticking out the bottom here? Oh, it's my pen. Okay, ooh, okay, sorry. Sorry to diverse, but digress, but look. Love this washi tape. This is cool. Look at the dark blue. Ooh, I have not seen washi tape like that. That's pretty cool. All right, sorry, I digress. All right, are you ready? <laughs> I'm even scared to roll this back. Oh my gosh, it's so heavy. A lot of it's the drills, but this is a lot of canvas, guys, a lot. Let's get... <laughs> Let's get the drills out. Bag one of drills. More information. There's more drills. Two bags of drills, but look at the colors. Oh my gosh. You guys know, if you've watched my channel long enough, you know I've got a thing for magic 
potions. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let me roll this back. Um, and I'll tell you my life story while I'm rolling this back because it's going to... It's gonna take a while to roll this thing back. It is a uh, horizontal diamond painting. It is not a vertical diamond painting. And I'm rolling, 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 rolling. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm rolling, roll. Okay. I think you've had I've too tried. much, you've had too much eggnog, honey. I, mean. I have not had any eggnog, okay. Um, I can barely zhuzh, zhuzh, zhuzh this. I mean, that's a lot of canvas. Uh, I can't wait to unroll this and actually see how big this is. I'm a little afraid. Okay, you have, oh, oh my gosh. Okay, there are so many colors in this that they put it on two different sticker sheets. Genovia art, I, Geno, Genovia art. Um, okay. I'm so sorry if I'm butchering that name, but um, that is the artist of Magic Potion, 71 colors. They could not even get them all on one inventory sheet. And you have got four AB drills. Um, if you look here, um, if the number, if your DMC code is under 150, it is an AB drill. You've got 120, 129, 130, and 132. No 141, which is surprising. You normally see 141 in Diamond Art Club, but this appears to be a blue a light greenish color, a golden color, and maybe an orange or a rust color. And look at that beautiful image. You know, I've got a thing for magic potions. This was right up my alley. I cannot wait to see this painting. All right, so yes, two different inventory sheets for this many colors. Uh, both of these sheets are sticker sheets, again, with the individually cut labels, but because it had to go on two sheets, you get a lot of plain white stickers that you can peel off and label whatever you need to, so that makes organization fun. Information sheet, as always, are you ready? Are you ready? <laughs> oh my gosh. I must be crazy. I really want to do this. I really want to do this. I wonder how long it's going to take somebody to do this. Oh, okay. It is hanging. Okay. So th it's hanging to the ground. Okay. So Marlon, let me, let me just kind of slide it over. This says white magic, sleep potion. Okay. Here we go. Are you ready? And it keeps going. It just keeps going and going and going, and going. Oh my goodness. <gasps> that, that's huge. They should have named it wallpaper to cover the <laughs> I know. How, okay, how do you frame this? Like, how would you frame it? Okay. Expensively. <laughs> okay, I'm six feet tall. I'm gonna hold it up for some perspective. Get me, I look terrible, guys, I'm so sorry. Okay, so ready? I am six feet tall. Hold on, I can't. This is barely touching the floor to give you some perspective as to how big this thing is. It's about, I would say, five, nine, <laughs> five feet, nine inches, five feet, ten inches. You can see the top of my head over this canvas, and it is touching the floor. That is crazy. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm going to sit back down. I just wanted to give you some perspective on the size of this massive thing, but, but guys, it is beautiful. This one is also out of stock, but it also has a notification. If you love it as much as I do, there's a love potion and you've got books in the background and these beautiful candles. Um, oh my gosh. I don't even, um, I wouldn't even know how to go through here and tell you where all of the ABs are. Like, I, it, we would sit here and take 12 hours. But the ABs, the symbols for the ABs are one, two, three, and four. I'm seeing fours. I mean, I'm, I'm seeing them all over the place. Like, there's looks to be a trophy right here. There are threes all in this trophy. There are twos in this bottle. Um they're in the books there this one um that says sleep potion the sleep potion words are all ab's 
Um, this one says collection of spells. That's all of the, the, the all of the words. Collection of spells are all fours. Um, they're fours in this one. What does this one say? Fairy potion. And look, there's a little fairy peeking out behind it. Oh my gosh, there is so much detail in this, guys. Butterflies. I mean, just, it goes on and on and on. Like, how would you frame this? I, I'm just going to have to find a way to frame this that, I mean, can you imagine paying for a custom frame for this? I, uh, no, I, I, wow. Marbles and hearts and just, it's unbelievable. It is unbelievable. Of course, you've got some ABs in your candles here. I just don't even know where to start with this, guys. That's huge. Like I said, the biggest area on a diamond painting Diamond Art Club has ever done. I can't imagine Train of Dreams beating this for length, but it did. Uh, but when you multiply the length times the height, the area is the biggest area on a diamond painting Diamond Art Club has ever done. But I want to do this. I just, I love the, the image. I love the rendering, obviously. Obviously, it's big enough to show the detail. Uh, that's not going to be a problem. Um, the, the wording is big enough, white magic. I can tell what all the words say. Um, this one says pearls. And so you've got this potion with pearls in it. I mean, I'm just looking and looking and looking. And every time I look, there's just more to be seen. There's a plate of something up on the top of these books. There's a gem here. Um, I could see so many absolutely wonderful opportunities to do some replacing with some of Tima's sparklers, some quad cubes, some slivers. I mean, if you need an opportunity to really try out sparklers and replace it, this would be the canvas to do it with. Oh my goodness. I'm speechless, which is hard to do for me, truly. I also love this, the scroll work in this. At the, I mean, again, I just keep seeing things. What do you think, Marlon? It's huge. It's huge. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm going to scroll through it again one more time so you can see it. But I held it up. I'm six feet tall, and it covered me up. So uh, it's a big one. I wonder how long it would take me to do this. What do we want to bet? This would, I mean, if I, but I, I'm just thinking, if I started it and worked on it and worked on nothing else, nothing else, no cross stitch, no coloring, nothing. I wonder how long it would take me to do it. I, I'm betting four to six months. Four to six months, easy. What do you think? Four to six months? You think I could do it in four to six months? I don't know. I may have to bid all you fine people a farewell because uh, I'm... <laughs> I may never, I may never be able to stop working on this thing. Wow. All right. Well, you saw it here first, guys. This is Magic Potion. Um, and you now have a gist of how big this sucker is. Uh, but it is beautiful. It is absolutely beautiful. So before I leave you, I want to thank you, Diamond Art Club, for continuing to put out just incredible images. I am so impressed. I'm a little overwhelmed, but that's on me. That's not on Diamond Art Club, of course. Um, I want to thank Dakota Dateweiler for this beautiful, beautiful horse uh, for her artwork and for the beautiful rendering from Diamond Art Club, Saint by Dakota Dateweiler. And I would also like to thank Diamond Art Club for Magic Potion by, I'm going to say, Genovia Art. So those are what I've got for you. This was Black Friday. This was Cyber Monday. I have some more. I didn't stop it too. Of course, I'm like everybody else. You just, you know, they're like Lay's potato chips. You can't eat just one. So um, I'll be doing some more unboxings. I've got some more uh, Dakota Date Weilers. I've got a Hannah Lynn um, and uh, some others. So I will continue to unbox for you, but I wanted to do these two first. I hope everyone has is having a fantastic week and is uh, getting your last minute decorating and gift shopping done for the holidays. Um, I know I didn't show all of the drills for the magic potion, but we would have been here for 12 years. Um, I'm trying to see if I can. I mean, there's so many drills. I'm like, I'm looking for the ABs. Okay, so here's an AB. It's 129. It's a yellow. 
there's a blue, there's an orange. So, I mean, if I get these out, we'll be here all day. Um, but anyway, I'm overwhelmed. Like, that was huge. <laughs> all right. Thank you guys for being here and for tuning in. And I will have some more unboxings. Hopefully, I will not be as overwhelmed as I was tonight. And I'll leave you with this. In a world where you can be anything, be kind. This is The Principal Painter, and I am signing off.